The Ukrainian people are being attacked from the air, from artillery, from ground troops and tanks. The debris of this war litters every street. But the government has warned for days of Russian saboteurs who have infiltrated the country to bring terror. Death squads who are attacking civilians in their cars as they flee. They do exist, as we found out. Oh, that's a bullet. That was a bullet. No, it wasn't a bullet. It wasn't. Something blew up under us. Something went bang. Oh, there's a big fuck-off hole. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, that's a bullet. Good. Good. Whoa! Whoa! What the f***? Whoa, whoa! Whoa! Stop! Where the f*** is everyone? Where is everyone? Here. Stop! We think it's a Ukrainian checkpoint and a mistake, so we identify ourselves. British journalists! 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 Journalista! Can anyone. You like right, Shay? Is everyone okay? Yeah. You okay, Dom? Yeah, I'm okay. <sighs> Somehow we have to get out of this, but the rounds keep coming. It's a professional ambush. Ow. The bullets oh, yeah. just don't miss. Okay. Whoa! Where can we go? Shall I crawl? Can we crawl down the embankment? Andre! Oh, Whoa! Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I'm hit, but escape the car, and with producer Dominic Van Heerden, we make our way down the embankment. Where are Camera operator Richie Mocker has taken two rounds to his body armour, but is still stuck in the car. Where are they? He runs for it in a hail of bullets. I'm running. The five of us have made it out of the car, down the embankment, and we just can't believe we're alive. Okay, guys, well done, everyone. I think I'm hit. Wait, okay, so yeah. Where, where, where? Shake. Okay. Hey, you. Hey, you. Hey, you. Hey, you. I, I definitely took something in the back of my pat plate. Yeah, he is. He is his. Okay. Give you a mid It's in the car. Let's, oh. I, wait, let's get out of here. Stuart, can you keep going? Stuart, just wait. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I want it. Yes, but I think we need to get out of here. Okay. Are you fine? Are you fine? Are you fine? Are you Stuart? Right. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
We've been ambushed. You've been fine. We come on a big fire. My car is destroyed. We've lost everything. Uh, I think I've been hit. I think I've been hit. Anybody got a No, we're all in the car. Yes, I have. Do you have to do this one? We are so caught with what we're going to do now. We have to try and get into some cover, but it's really, really dangerous yeah, here. I we uh, well, to see if we can get out. I certainly do. We need to get back up to those cops. So you're bleeding from the head as well. Before these guys follow up, we need to get out. Okay, let's go. Yeah, and you're bleeding from the head. Let's go through there behind that wall. Go on in. We run into a warehouse unit looking for cover. Go. One at a time. Three caretakers beckon us inside. Yeah. Yeah. Let's so, um, Producer Martin Val starts coordinating a rescue plan with Sky Star. We know any rescue will take hours. And they need We're to stuck, get us. fighting outside. We've no idea what's going on. into a garage somehow we found our way in there's three guys working here and they've said we can stay but there's a lot of firing going on outside um we don't know why it appears to be shooting it's a big fight we might even be on the front line and we're hoping the military come to get us but who knows okay, i'm going to stop rolling okay she's camping After a mammoth logistical effort, we were rescued by the local police. We were lucky. Thousands of Ukrainians are not. And every day, this war gets worse here. Stuart Ramsey, Sky News, Kiev.